Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Rohan Khandelwal. I'm the lead consultant and head breast surgeon at CK Birla Hospital, Gurgaon. In this video, I'm going to talk about breast mammography and breast ultrasounds and how should you choose whether you need to get a mammogram done or an ultrasound done. Well, the simple difference is that if you're less than 40 years of age, we usually don't recommend mammograms. And the reason behind that is that in young patients, there are dense breasts. And in dense breasts, we cannot differentiate a lump from the breast tissue and that is why mammographies don't give us a lot of information. So if you're less than 40 and if you have a breast problem, you're more likely to undergo a breast ultrasound. Now breast ultrasound does not involve any radiation and it helps us in also differentiating a solid lump from a lump which has fluid inside it. Because it does not have any radiation, ultrasounds are also safe if a lady has a breast lump during pregnancy. Breast ultrasounds are very well tolerated and they usually are painless. If we talk about mammograms, we usually recommend them after 40 years of age and there are certain things which you need to know regarding mammograms. The amount of radiation exposure in mammograms is very less. So the myth that you know getting mammograms done repeatedly can increase your risk of cancer that is a myth and it's not it does not hold true so even if you get yearly mammograms it will not increase your risk of breast cancer there's another myth that mammograms are very painful if you get mammograms done before your periods when the breasts are engorged yes they can be painful so that is why we recommend that mammogram should be done a few days after the periods. Now if you're going in for a mammogram, make sure that you're not wearing any deodorant that day and especially not using talcum powder. Because the particles of the talcum powder can show up as calcification on the mammogram and that can confuse the radiologist, then report it as a cancerous lesion. So that is why it is always recommended that, that you don't wear any talcum powder or cologne or perfume prior to a mammogram and you always clean your breasts before you get the mammography done. So this is how we choose whether to get a mammogram or an ultrasound. If you like the video, don't forget to press the like button and do share it with your friends and family. If you have any questions regarding your breast ultrasound or mammography report, please do write it in the comment section and I'll be happy to answer that. Thank you.